Hey guys, Tom and Temptation here, just showing you a quick tutorial on how to speed up your computer by adding virtual RAM for free. First of all, you go to Start Control Panel. Uh, at the top right hand corner, there should be like a search box. You just click on that and type in Advanced System Settings. And at the left hand corner there should be a box that says system and view advanced system settings so what you want to do is click on view advanced system settings and uh, click on view advanced system settings and it should come up with a um, it should come up like this on the computer name tab well, only, what you want to do is click on the advanced tab under where it says performance you want to click settings uh, forget about the visual effects and just click on advanced now here's a bit where you change everything which is a virtual memory click change and go down to the, the middle bit and I've already changed mine so it's a maximum but it, the initial size should come up t um, should be about 3300 and 3300 about 56 if you're running a dual core laptop like I am I don't know if that's the same on other laptops because I haven't done this but that's just like a hunch sort of thing but all you do is change the initial size to the maximum size allocated and click set and ok that's the first step in speeding up your computer but if you want to make it a lot quicker and efficient you will need a 2 to 4 gig memory stick no earlier than um, 2008 I think so check that and insert it like you would normally into USB socket or you also need um, USB 2.0 yeah 2. USB 2.0 to um, run this and you just click on go to start my computer and where it comes up is your memory stick you want to right click on it go right down to the bottom where it says properties um, go scroll along to where it says ready boost um, and where it says use this device click on use this device it shall be the minimum megabytes allowed but just you put it right to the top which is 3799 which uh, is um, 3.71 um, 3 gigabytes if I'm correct click apply and click OK yeah 3.71 gigabytes and that's giving you 3.71 gigabytes of virtual RAM to your computer on top of your normal RAM and to the um, file RAM that we just um, changed as well which is making this computer from a 4 gig to around about an uh, 8 gig of RAM obviously that's not actual RAM it's virtual RAM but it works the same sort of it's like um it's like and I hope this um tutorials helps you out um Tom and Temptation out bye